Yeah, okay, cool. Hi, and welcome to this very first stream of um, my um, Nuzlocke run for Pokemon Black and White. Okay, I just fucked that up by going full screen. Let's not do full screen then. Does that fix it? Sorry for the bumps. I've never done this before. Playing a Pokemon game with a very, very legit free uh, streaming technique. I mean, a DPS streaming technique, obviously, this is a very legit procedure. Um, yeah, no. I've been wanting to do a Pokemon stream for a while. I've been stuck with boring Far Cry for like five fucking years or something. And now I was like, you know, let's do a stream. Let's do a Pokemon stream and let's do something fun. Um, so I decided I was going to do, um, I was going to do a, um, a Nuzlocke challenge. And, you know, actually, like, it's a bit awkward to admit it, but I've actually, I haven't actually finished Black and White since the fir very first time that I started them. Like, I finished it that time, and it, that's been, like, what, seven years or something? Something like that? And for somebody who's, like, who says that they love Pokemon and, you know, devote a lot of time to Pokemon, it's a bit embarrassing that they haven't played through the fifth generation more than once. It is. I will, I will not pretend otherwise. Um, so I was thinking, yes, let's do this. Um, let's try to give these games another chance, shall we? Um. I mean, it's not like, I don't hate the games, it's not like I hate them, it's just, I'm not very fond of, I'm not very fond of a lot of the choices that they made in making the game, so there's a lot of, like, I'm not very fond of the generation itself, the designs of the Pokemon, and, uh, that's not like me being one of those, oh, the first generation was the only good generation type of people, because I'm very much not that person. But it's, um, I, I mean, I'm very fond of, like, Generation 6, 7, uh, yeah. Is there an 8? <laughs> is there an 8 one? Or is 8 the one coming up now? Yes, 8 is the one coming up now. The 7 is, oh, uh, yeah. Um, uh, anyway. No, um, I'm just, I was just never really fond of the way that they did the design, and also the, the, the way the game looks, and, oh, uh, yeah. I have issues. But I'm going to be open-minded, I'm going to, um, give this another try, and I'm hopefully gonna like it. Okay? Cool, yeah. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Thank you for the Tokyo Liver. I mean, I enjoy her. She's nice. Pixel art is a bit, like... <sighs> Come on, Mink, you know? By the way, let me know if there's like any of the settings that are a bit off because I haven't actually done this before with the um, like considering the audio and um, the, from this game and also uh, just yeah. Let me know if there's anything that's a bit off, if the volumes are correct or not because I didn't actually test it because I was very excited. That's right. This world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. Five games, five generations of games, Pokemon have mysterious powers, they come in many shapes and live in many different places. Humans live happily with Pokemon, living and working together, we complement each other. We help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks. Fighting Pokemon battles one another is particularly popular and it deepens the bonds between people and Pokemon. And that is why I researched it. Your turn now. Well, that's enough for me. Can you tell me about yourself? You know, I'm not, I'm not gonna pretend that I'm gonna choose the boy, or that there's a single part of me that wants to choose the boy. Like, I, I will be that gay cliche and say that I cannot play as the main character. I need to play as her. Look at her hair. Look at her shorts. She made choices, and she has a red bag. She deserves to be commended. Those choices. I'm gonna go for that. Yes, I am a girl, although gender is so 2000. I'd like to know your name. Now, see, that is the problem. I need to 
I'm very bad with Pokemon when it comes to naming the characters and when it comes to naming the actual Pokemon. Which is why I was hoping that there was an audience here that could already be, be screaming suggestions at me when it comes to the names. That would be very handy. Um, okay. What if I'm just like... What is the name of the actual character? No, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. <laughs> like, I'm Ash. I'm playing as Ash. Thank you. Um, who does she feel like? Does she feel like a um, Susan? Is she a Susan? <laughs> okay, I need the viewer's help. What is her name? What do I go for as a theme? I feel like there needs to be a cohesive theme for the nicknames of the characters, um, and I, because I'm terrible at it. So, what is her name? Her name is like, I don't know, Carol? Carol Ann? <laughs> Actually, Unova is based on, is that based on America? Yes it is, isn't it? It's based on... Yeah, it has to, yeah, that's America, because, uh, Carlos and France, yeah. Um, we should give her a very typical American name, I feel. She could be, she could be... Somebody help me. Uh, her name is gonna be... I feel like I want to give her a very basic name, but then again, does she deserve a basic name? She could be a she could be a Brenda, she could be a Caroline, she could be a Susan, she could be a Barbara, she could be a. I don't know. I mean, when it comes to the previous trainers, they've like if you have May and you have Brendan, and then you have um, Dawn, and what's that dish in the uh, in the Carlos region? The one that Ash gives to his Ash. And Misty, they're very like nature. Nature is gone. Misty. Is that a flower? That is a flower. Mayflower. It's like just a Mayflower. Anyway. <laughs> um, she could be like. I was gonna say Lily, but there's already a Lily. The blonde bitch who takes the whole of the attention in both my sun and moon. Um, she could be a. She could be a. She could be a. I don't know. She's gonna be. She's gonna be a friend, though, actually. I think. Yeah. The Pokemon is a separate team. If somebody else comes up with a special idea, I have no idea. Your name is Brenda. Yes, it is. So your name is Brenda. What a wonderful name. Thank you very much. I spent too much time thinking about it. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your two best friends. <laughs> Fuck. God, they don't actually capitalize the entire name. It's like, yeah, Sharon. Seems a little difficult, but a very honest person. And we have Bianca. And then we have Brenda. Okay, she's a little... <laughs> I thought you said flirty. She's a little flighty, but she works hard. And with Brenda, I think I'm going to give you a very important token. Yes, it will accompany me on my journey. Thank you. Friend new people and Pokemon, and then fight them to the death. Thank you, Professor Juniper. Oh, they have the seasons here, I forgot. Okay, cool. Come on, Jane. Jane Freak? Come on, Game Freak. Seasons? Oh, I forgot. I'm not fond of the art style in this game, but I will keep the wine and cheese. Mm. Oh, I need to be strong. I'm very bad. Brenda! Heard from Professor Juniper. We can have a Pokemon? What's keeping Bianca? I 
mean, she's a bit flighty. Oh, Lordy, you only the key. Am I a little kid? So sorry. Bianca, I've known for ten years that you have no sense of time, but seriously? Wait, actually, how old are these characters? Tomod! <sighs> Thank you so much, I need you here, because I have no names for people, and I need names for people. But actually, if they've known each other for ten years, how fucking old are they? Because I thought we were supposed to get Pokemon when we were ten. Today's the day we get a Pokemon for Professor Juniper. Our lives to this point have just been futile, pointless. I know, sorry, Miranda. Sorry, Terrence. My mic is kind of low. I will turn it the fuck up. Is this better for you? Let me know. So, where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to Branda's house. So Branda gets first pick. Naturally. <laughs> I love the logic. Thank you. I was a bit I've never streamed a DS or a 3DS game before, so I wasn't a bit I was a bit like unsure of like the, the audio levels and whatever. Um Naturally. Um the Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box! Okay, Branda! You go first and take a peek at the gift box. I want to meet the Pokemon right now! Okay. I opened the gift box. I brought three Pokemon, one for you and one for each of your friends. Please settle your choices politely. Enjoy your Pokemon. Mercy. Okay. Um, we are gonna go for... Um... Nope. Nope. Never. Snivy, come on, Snivy. I, it's probably the one that I started with the first time I played these games. That's the point. I only played these games once before, so it's a bit. I don't remember them at all. And I didn't finish the second ones, the sequels. I bought them, but I didn't play them through. Who did you guys choose? Okay. She got the stupidest one. Sorry. Let's have a Pokemon battle in my room. It's so tidy. I don't need your fucking otter tearing up my house. Good. Yeah, okay, cool. It's that old Branda. Oh, this battle game is... It's okay, I suppose. How are you, Tomod? What are you doing? Oh my god. Okay. I will kill you. Not Tomod. I will kill uh, the Pokemon. Let's see. Okay. I have Tackle and Leer. Die. It's very exciting. I will actually need to find, um... Oh, um, find a sprite. Because I need a sprite for the actual thing. Where's, where are the official sprites? Because I can't just steal somebody else's random sprite online. I'm not a robot, thank you very much, internet. Last trip in Stavanga at the moment. Okay, so you'll be back home in... What, in, in May then? That would be brilliant. Well, actually, will you be home at the end of May? Is that, then I would actually maybe be able to see you. That'd be cool. Actually, where the fuck do you find these uh, official sprites Pokemon? Wednesday. Okay, cool. Because I, I wanted to celebrate my birthday while I, when I was home. Um, and I'm going to be home at the end of the month for a couple of days. Oh my god. 
how fucking small is this fucking photo? This is so small. This is never gonna work. Um. Ba Pokemon one. Do you actual like I haven't been watching a lot of streams myself, but do actual streamers when they do this, when they choose, when they go in and find their Pokemon, do they actually do it like this, like super slowly? Oh, there he is, little snivy bastard. There we go. Okay, cool. He's there now. Very cute, I must say. Is it, is it a nice place? Is it like a massive, cool, cool-ass place? Is it a gamer pad? Now let's kill it. Oh shut up, that's massive. Is it, is it, wait, is it actually, okay, so it's, um, so it's not at his old house. You're not just moving into his current apartment, you you guys are moving out and getting your own place? And that means you'll be close to Sandra as well, as long as she's home. Oh see, we ruined our fucking room, bitch. As a tips for you, Tormod. Don't have Pokemon battles inside. Yes! I'm very happy for you. It's gonna be great. I'm also moving at the end of the month. So I'm stressed out about moving and things. Whoa, what happened? What did you think happened, Bianca? We fucking told you. Sorry about your room, Brenda. You're completely hopeless. Wait, is this the game that introduced the whole No matter where you go, we're gonna heal you. You're never gonna be alone. No, there's always gonna be some bitch around the corner who's, can, who's able to heal you completely. Is this the game that introduced that, or was that X and Y? There was one of them. I'm sure you can battle without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. Cool. Let me walk. Oh, wait, I have to fight him. I'm gonna be positive. It's it's gonna be a good experience, this game. Have you ever played these games, Tormod? Because I've only played them once, and uh, there's a reason I only played them once. And I'm trying to be very not negative about it. I don't want to fight this pig. Murder. Uh, black and white. Or black and white too. It probably doesn't matter. They're probably the same games. Ish. Although I've, I've heard that black and white too have some sort of a, a difficulty thing. Yeah, okay, so you won't be able to help me then, sadly. I've never been very fond of their art style or the generation itself, but um, I've decided I, I should give them a new chance and uh, be kind, I guess. Ah, oh, so that is the Pokemon battle, that is true. I made a strange blunder in my first battle, but this feeling I have, I'm finally a trainer. Ooh, three viewers, baby. Ooh. I better come too. How do you find my very custom made, very arts and crafts theme? Are you enjoying them? I made them all myself. <laughs> now walk, bitch. Come on, Brand. I'm very several sorry for about all the trouble, ma'am. We can clean up. Cleaning up? No worries, I'll take care of it later. 
Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper and get the fuck out of my life? I don't have a daughter. It looks bad. <laughs> Thank you. It was actually an old Tumblr theme that I had and I just sort of like flipped it and I remo removed the copyrighted material and I added my own little drawings about of, <laughs> of Oddish and Shroomish and I was like, yes, I am an art now. Let's go thank Professor Juniper and get the fuck out of your mom's house. I gotta go home first. Thanks for having us over. Um, a Nuzlocke challenge is basically if your Pokemon dies, you lose it. You have to delete it. And you can only catch one Pokemon per route, per new area that you get into. So there is a limited amount of Pokemon that you get. So if you if they all die, you've lost. So it's a it's it's a way for players who want more of a challenge to um, get that challenge since Nintendo or Game Freak are not going to give it to us through difficulty levels. <laughs> Pokemon battles! No, wait, that's not her voice. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? That sure reminded me of my first Pokemon battle. Oh, and you know, after a battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. Thank you. That was a good advice, ma'am. Your Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your cross transceiver a watch X transceiver cross transceiver you're gonna thank the professor too right better get going honey oh oh god oh a little swoobat no wait that's a woobat isn't it the Woobat is the first one, and the Swoobat is, is the second one. Okay, yeah, I believe so. I'm sorry, but you can... <laughs> it's like, please don't go anywhere else. You're supposed to go to Bianca's house. We cannot have you walking outside of where we want you to go. What kind of platform is this? This is the DS. This is um the original DS. No! 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 A thousand times no! I can't do that. My voice is not like that. Babe, I'm a good trainer. I've got a Pokemon and everything. I can totally go on an adventure. Ah. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll be waiting for you in the front of the lab, okay? Thank you. It it does it doesn't look bad on the stream. It does, and I'm very happy. Um. Oh my God! Can I just run already? Can I get the running shoes? Let's go meet the professor. I don't remember his voice. Ten points to Ravenclaw. Oh, McGonagall. I was. Her, I don't know what her voice was. Hi there, I've been waiting for you young people. Let me introduce myself again. My name is Professor Juniper. We know your name, it's been 10 minutes. Come, come, Charon. It's, this is not a time to take things lightly. Today is a day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, once and again, my name is Professor Juniper and I'm researching when and how the creatures called Pokemon came into existence. I'm American, because this generation was based on America. Oh, that's unusual. You already had a Pokemon battle. It didn't take you more than two minutes to get your creatures and throw them at each other and make them fight to the death. So maybe that's why. It feels as though your Pokemon have already began to trust you. By the way, give it a nickname. Okay, now that I have you guys here. There needs to be some sort of a theme. I need to name my Pokemon after something. Um, what should it be? Because I have no idea because I'm very bad with names. Do you guys think, should, like we could do like, we could do pop stars, we could do um, wizards, we could do sodas, we could do foods, we could do, um, we could do viewers. We could have one mic in and one tool mode. We could, I'm gonna do that. Unless you guys have a better idea. Because that would, yeah. Because I can never trust my gut. 
It's not a good idea. Um, because it, but then again, if I had a tool mod and a mic in, like, if one of them dies and I'll have to delete it, it would be very sad. Like, rest in piss. That would be very sad. I'm gonna go for it. Like, name it after my viewers, I guess. But then again, what if I never have six views? I have to make them up. No one will know. Except I'm planning to upload these to YouTube so that there is a complete Let's Play sort of experience. Because I like, I mean, at least when you do like a Nestlock challenge, there is a bit of like, there is some value to being able to watch the entire thing. And I can appreciate that. Okay. Give me your idea, the one in Norwegian, provide it to me. I feel like maybe. You could do celebrities. But that's a bit boring. Name them after what they're best at beating. So this would be water. I think I, I want it to be more personal or more like have more flavor to it. Do you know, know what I mean? Like I the last time I did it, I think I had drag queens, and then at the time after that, I think I had um. I'm very close to the camera. I've just become aware. Um, and I think I had like I had sodas one time. So I had a Pepsi. Or maybe that was my sister, actually. I have no idea, but I enjoy the idea. So I'm gonna say that it was mine. <laughs> Shout out to my sister. Oh, I enjoy that better. It could be Aqua, but then again, I would have a grass type named Aqua. So that's a bit like... I think this is gonna be, this is gonna be tool mode. And then the next one is gonna be my camp and that will push people to watch the stream so that there will be <laughs> hopefully at some point there will be six viewers in total there we go this is tool mode thank you for your idea i really i need the ideas so yeah wait is that is that what i'm doing is that is that okay okay uh-uh athy are you okay with the nickname tool mode tool mode is its name that is such a great name as for why I gave all of you Pokemon, I have nothing better to do, because I don't want to leave my house. It's for the Pokedex, right? Pokedex? I'm astonished. No, wait, that's the mom's voice. Nice work, Charon. Oh my gosh, shut the fuck up. Can I just start the adventure? I'm very keen. I just want to fight. I came here to fight. We could have done Nickelodeon characters as well, actually. But I don't know that many. They would all be from Rugrats, probably. Tommy, Dill, Lil, Thil, Chucky, Angelica, Cynthia. Susie, was that the black girl who came in the second season that I never watched? You have the- you have given me the best possible answer. Mercy. Thank you. Thank you. I- oh, I don't need you to teach me. I know more than you. Shut up. I'm walking- I'm leaving you guys. You cannot stop me. Look at the speed. You'll never catch up. Holy shit, no. <laughs> How did you catch me? Oh, there you are. And what did the professor have to say? She asked you to complete the Pokedex. I can't believe it. Well, actually, I came. I already knew she was going to ask. She's played the games before, apparently. That's why I brought the three of you these town maps. 
take them with you. Yes, my name is Brand. <laughs> it's like, I didn't have any viewers when I named the character. Nobody was able to steer me away from the bad advice. I was like the nearest in the middle of everywhere, anywhere, with nobody to guide me. So I made a bad decision. <laughs> Brenda obtained the town map. Thank you. Here you are. Cheer. I'll take good care of it, ma'am. I had one for you too, Bianca. Oh, thank you so much. As for your room, Brenda, or what's left of it. No need for any of you to worry. I'll take care of tidying up. I mean, of course you will. Do you have a life? You have no life. You're literally doing nothing. Your husband is probably dead. Okay, Brenda. And you don't have a job, from what it seems like anyway. Ah, oh, Pokemon, they are so cute, but they have enough power to destroy a bedroom. They are really something. With Pokemon like that at your side, you'll be safe wherever you go. Bitch, I have a little Snivy. It's like a little rat. I don't know it's a snake. It's like a snake with legs. There are demons out here. Dragons, bitch. <laughs> it can't, my little snake can't defend me from a dragon. I'll let your parents know. I hope that, in addition to Pokemon, you'll find lots and lots of places you like in the Unova region. And become wonderful adults. Have a great trip. Okay. Sure, Jen. If I use the town map, I'll always know where I am. That's certainly helpful. Shall we head to Route 1? The professor is waiting. Let's go, let's go, Brandon. Hurry up and come to, okay? God, I hate them already. I really... Uh... I want to walk by myself. Who is this child? Nobody. My 17th of May, the National Day in Norway, was actually, I mean, it was, it was quite decent. Like, it was my first day of, like, day drinking ever. I've never been the one to drink throughout the entire day, but I did. So it was exhausting. I honored my country in the only way I knew how. Brenda, it's this way. Bianca says if we're starting a journey together, she wants us all to take our first step at the same time. Oh my god. Hey, Brenda, let's all take our first step on Road to One together. One, two. Oh my god, that was so emotional. How was your 17th of May? I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? No, that's not her voice. I wonder what would happen. Isn't this so exciting? It sure is. Come on, the professor's waiting. Well, gosh darn it. <laughs> professor Juniper, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Now that everyone's here, I'll explain. The P Pokedex's pages automatically update whenever you meet a Pokemon. Moreover, it's set up so that you obtain even more information when you catch a Pokemon. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokemon. Oh, a Patrat. Do you think she can handle it? Dicks out for that Minkino, you know, because it's going to get eaten. I'm out of Pepsi. Thank you. This part of the game is so interesting. It's brilliant. Let me just move my camera a little bit. A little bit. <sighs> cool. I suppose. No. Like this. Okay, cool. Like this. Yes. Okay, there we go. 
So in this challenge thing, you're not allowed to make that one yours. No, this is not mine. This is hers. Uh, I mean, that's not... Um, um, this doesn't count, because this is the Troyo area. But basically, the first Pokemon that I find when I actually have the Pokeballs, because you don't have the Pokeballs yet, the first Pokemon that I find will be will have to be the one that I catch. Or if I kill it, if I accidentally kill it, I don't get to capture it. Which makes it all challenging. And it also forces you to utilize um, Pokemon that you normally wouldn't use. Oh, did I get the Pokeballs now? While I was reading? Yes, Brenda did obtain the Pokeballs. She forgot to say the Pokemon jump at you. I'm heading to Accumula Town too. She, he doesn't have a voice. I can't do male voices. I think I'll go too. I'm looking forward to the next town where I can go shopping for Pokeballs. Wait a minute. Hey, listen. Brenda. Shira. I thought some fun. But we need to get going. I'd imagine the professor's waiting too. Would you just listen to sex? Seriously. Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? Bitch, that, well, that's what we're doing. That is literally what we're doing. That is the point of the game. We complete the Pokedex. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was going to say Branda. Bianca, where the fuck have you been? Um. Huh, actually, that sounds interesting. It will fill out Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please the professor too. Okay then, until we reach Accumula Town, take care of healing your Pokemon at your house. I'm pretty sure it's like 10 meters. Tumud, you don't know what a Nuzlocke is. It's basically a challenge. Wait, are you asking where the term come from, comes from or the, the challenge, what the challenge is? Um. Me and Oshawa will do the best for sure. Uh, basically, the Nuzlocke challenge is just, it, it gives you a set of rules where um, if a Pokemon dies in battle, your Pokemon dies in battle, you have to delete it. You can't actually keep it. And you can only capture one Pokemon per route that you go into. So, it's a bit tricky. It's challenging, or it's supposed to be challenging anyway. Um, and it forces you to try new Pokemon and um, yeah. It's hard, and it's heartbreaking when you have to delete them, or not be able to use them anymore. Bookmarker, yo! How are you, my darling? Now, I'm about to find the first Pokemon in this Nuzlocke challenge, so, you know, it's probably gonna be shit. Who am I hoping for? I don't even know who you can find here, but I'm hoping it's not a fucking bat rat. That is for fucking sure. Oh... Find it. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh. I believe the two of you know each other, Bookmarke and Happy Spring Marky. Okay, so there is a pat rat here, and I'm going to have to fight it and catch it. And not die myself, because if I die, then I'm fucking dead. Okay, okay, Can I, do I dare tackle again? Yes, I do dare. Come on, tackle it, bitch. Fuck. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I fucked it up! <sighs> oh well, at least I don't have to do, <laughs> at least I don't have to use a pat rat. Just yet, anyway. Okay, so this is route one. Yeah, fuck off. You guys gonna give me some items? And basically, there are variations of, um... Yes, thank you. Give me a potion. Um, basically, there are variations of the challenge where, like, if you want it to be extremely difficult, you can also say that you can't actually use the Poké Centers to heal. So you'll just have to heal with things that you find out in the field. And that makes it pretty much fucking impossible. See, I, I could have had this little bitch, and that would have been a massive fucking pooch after a while. 
kill it. The, the next one will be my gun because I've said, I've said so. Don't leer me, I don't like that. I don't like that. I will keep my defenses up. Thank you very much. Kill that dog. The next one will be my kin. I just have to wait for the next route before I actually can catch that. Oh. I could have had a lily pop. And not that I'm like a big fan of lily pop or whatever, but it's it's nicer than fucking Pat Rat. What are you guys staring at? Brando, are you going to compare yourself with Bianca? I don't need to. <laughs> Both Bianca. Oh, he is a shady bitch. Both Bianca and I have two Pokemon with us. How about it, Brenda? Do you want to compare which one of us has the most Pokemon with them? Let's compare. If you only have Snivy, if you don't catch any Pokemon, won't Snivy get lonely as long as he lives? I, I don't care if he's lonely. He has me, as long as he still lives and breathes. Oh my god, are we getting a phone call? It's like, they don't even want me to do anything. How is every- oh, I love this chat. I wish- oh my god, wouldn't it be so cool if our bitmojis were in this style? Like, Ken Sugimui style? That would be fucking amazing. Um... Huh. <clears throat> Hello, how is everybody doing? You and your Pokemon are getting along great now, right? Oh, Professor. No, wait. <laughs> I was talking. Right now, I'm, for, I'm in front of the Accumula Towns Pokemon Center. I'd like to show you around or hurry on. Whoa. So hurry on over, everyone. Okay, the Pokemon Center there. Jesus. Yes, leave me alone. I've lost the game already. Now... Is that a Pokeball down there? Did I see? No. La 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 la. Can I run? Is it possible for me to run in this game? Ah, oh, Branda, there you are. Traveling with your Pokemon is truly one of the joys of being a trainer. Please follow me. I'd like to show you some of the most important places for a Pokemon trainer. Oh god. This is a Pokemon Center. Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Well, okay, let's start your tour. Thank you for the rhyme, bitch. Oh, wait for me. A Pokemon Center is a truly incredible place. Do you know why? Because your Pokemon can be healed. This isn't America, because this is free healthcare. No, so... <laughs> And what's more, it's absolutely free. Must be Canada. A Pokemon fan or as a trainer's best friend. Here, Brenda, give it a try. Oh. <laughs> yes, that's a good point. I shouldn't be talking to you. Heal him. My buddy. My beautiful, beautiful Snivy. My beautiful Tormod. Thank you for waiting. We've been sold your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay, now that your Pokemon are rested, I'll show you how to use the PC at a Pokemon Center. Jesus Christ. This is the PC, it's free to use. La la la. Yes, no, it is a very long tutorial. But it feels very long, but it's like, just get through this, this bullshit. Like, oh God. I'm well, sorry if I just waved air into the microphone there. Heal me, daddy. <sighs> Can she just leave? Can she just leave already? I, I, I don't want these friends. I don't need them. Let's wrap this up. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. When you get to Striaton Town, go and meet an inventor called named Nain Fennel. I need to keep these voices going, Jesus. She's a friend of mine from long ago, and I'm sure she'll help you on your way. Best of luck. I hope that your journey's proved to be the adventure of a lifetime. Her <laughs> making accent gets thicker every single time I do it. 
Ooh, what should I buy? Potions and Pokeballs are definitely important. Um, thank you. Go away. Let me buy some. No, actually, how the fuck do I... Oh, oh. Thank you. May I help you? I will get some Pokeballs. Actually, probably, I mean, five isn't enough. No, no. I need ten. Because then they'll give me an extra Premier Ball as well. Yes, mercy. Mercy Bell Coat. And I'll, I'll have a couple of potions because I'm scared as fuck. Thank you very much. You put away the potions in the medicine case. No, I'm done. I'm gonna leave now. Wait, this isn't where I have to like... Oh my god, why are they talking? Why are they talking so much? Is there a storyline in this game? The only story... Oh, my babies. The, the villains. Is this Plasma? This is Team Plasma, right? Yes. <laughs> my name is Gepsis. I am here representing Team Plasma. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. I am sure most of you believe that we humans and Pokemon are partners. That we have come to live together because we want and need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume that this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to the selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around when they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in what I am saying? Jesus. They do say that Black and White does have a good storyline. Now ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain something, something, something. Tell me what is your responsibility towards these wonderful beings called Pokemon? That's right, we must liberate the Pokemon. Then and only then will humans and Pokemon truly be equals. Everyone, I am a word here today by imploring you to consider the relationship between po people and Pokemon and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. This post has been sponsored by Squarespace. Let's leave, thank you. Oh. You're watching Friends and Joey is in love to the Rachel. Mm. Yes, that was a horrible mistake, wasn't it? <laughs> About that speech, what do you think we should do? Liberate that Pokemon? I mean, they pose a valid question, to be fair. Oh god, can we just shut the fuck up? How, what should his name, his voice be like? <clears throat> I can only do women's voices. You and I, sex unilex. Um, what should his voice be? Um, what is his name? Set or N? I don't know. Something. Just now, it was saying. Slow down. You talk too fast. <laughs> What's this about Pokemon talking? That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they're talking. Oh, then the two of you can't hear it either. How's that? My name is N. <laughs> Whose voice is that? There's some character in some show or whatever, or a game, that has that exact voice in mind. <laughs> My name is Sharon, and this is Brenda. We were asked to complete the Pokedex, and we just left on our journey. My main goal is to become the champion, though. So, you're gonna confine many, many Pokemon and Pokeballs for that, then? Hmm, I'm a trainer too, but I can't help wondering. Are Pokemon really happy that way? Well, well, Miranda, is it? Let me hear your Pokemon's voice again. Oh my god. I didn't train. Is he gonna have a high level one? I barely made it into the city. Please don't be higher. Oh my god, he's level seven. He might actually kill me. Oh, holy shit. Come on, now, nah, baby. Tormod, you will fuck him up. What did he use? Growl. Oh my god, I'm actually nervous. 
More, let me hear the voice of your Pokemon. Don't scratch me, bitch. Oh god. Oh, that was a critical hit. I'll be fine. I think. Stop scratching me, stupid puss. Oh. <laughs> don't scratch me. I'm so scared. I don't. <laughs> this game mode is like it's so bad for the anxiety. Bye, bitch. Bye, puss. Level eight. Tormod took over. Yes. I never expected to hear Pokemon say such things. Yeah. Where is that character from? <laughs> Fuck. As long as Pokemon are confined in Pokeballs, Pokemon will never become perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon because they are my friends. Oh. Huh, strange guy. But I'm not gonna worry about it. Trainers and Pokemon help each other out. Listen, I'm going on ahead. I want to battle the gym leader in the next town, Striaton City. Aim to battle the gym leader after gym leader. The best way for a trainer to become stronger is to challenge the gym leaders in each area. Thank you for that. Jesus Christ, can I just leave now? Okay, bitch, I will see you. Uh, yeah, no. I have to heal because I'm terrified. And I still don't have a second Pokemon. Like, having a second Pokemon will help. Even if it's like a weak, shitty Pokemon. Because that will just... It'll give me somebody that I can, like, switch to. And then they can, um... Um, I can use them to heal my other ones. But when do I get the running shoes, though? Because this is... This is horrible. Oh, actually, I don't actually know which button is the- Oh! Just open the menu. Let me just go to- Um, no. Um, should I do shift or set? Actually, shift. I'm terrified. Um. Cool. Oh, I crashed into a tree. Okay. Okay. Well, at least the date is correct. Good. Good for it. I need to save this game. This is still totally a legit 3DS. DSM. Capture card device thing. Yeah, that is what it is. Oh my god, can they just literally leave me alone for two seconds? I haven't been able to walk for two seconds. Oh my god. Shut up, mom! Brenda. It's your mom. How are things? Are you and your Pokemon getting along and enjoying your journey so far? I needed to talk to you, so I call, but I'm gonna hang up. The tr What the fuck was that phone call? What the fuck? Brenda. I finally caught up with you and look how far you've come already. I haven't even left the fucking house. I'm basically at the door still. Professor Juniper said that you were probably headed up for a Striathon City right now. I have another present for you, Brenda. Try these on my fucking shoes. Thank you, mom. So sorry I yell at you. When you're wearing the running shoes, you can go anywhere in a flash. Let me read you the instructions. Hold the B button to run faster than normal. Thank you. Thank you, Mom. Oh my god. You're never alone. Yeah, we get it. You watch football. You like Liverpool. Now I can... Oh, I can run. Look at that hair fly. Holy shit. Oh. Yeah, I don't want to... Okay. Give me a Pokemon. Yes! A Purloin! Okay, yeah! This will be mine. I will get this, okay? We will fight this and get it. We will not kill it. Oh, okay. Okay, that's good. He growled. <gasps> no! No! How? Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> Why? 
Why did you have to critical hit right there, baby? Why? That's the entire route ruined. I can't even get anything here now. Oh my god. Jesus. Okay then. I'll fight you, kid. Let me murder you. Jimmy. Holy shit. I cannot believe that just happened. I can't believe I've just done this. Oh. Yes, good. Critical hit that bitch as well. It goes so smoothly when you don't actually have the animations. Just nice. Who is this man? I'm gonna fight you too. You're gonna. Woo! <laughs> That's cool, man. Definitely super cool. Oh my god. I really love Pokemon battles. Cause my Pokemon is so fucking cute. Oh, are you gonna rub that in my fucking face? The fact that you have a purloin? Thank you very much. I hate you, whatever your name is. Oh, I'm so sorry that I'm swearing so much. Like, you guys have to tell me if it gets too much. Because I've just watched... Seven seasons of Veep, you know, the HBO show with Julia Louis Dreyfus, Louis Dreyfus, Louis Dreyfus, and it's it's just basically seven seasons of swearing. So I'm I'm in that mindset right now, and I'm so sorry. Even though I lost, I'm still cute. Not that cute, Jan. It would be so nice if I could actually capture any of the Pokemon that I find in this grass. Youngster Roland, okay. Come at me, this little puppy. Have you watched Veep? I'm so happy to hear that. How much have you seen? Yes, die, puppy. But at this point, like, my Snivy is gonna level up high, and it's like, it's gonna get harder and harder to actually, like, only damage these Pokemon. Thank you so much for dropping by, Tomod. It's been, it's, it's very nice to have you here always, and I can't wait to see your place when I, when I come back home. Oh my god, this is so confusing. There are actually two ways for me to go. Brenda, come on, Brenda. Why? I've literally. Oh, I can't even. Like, I literally don't have a minute to myself. These people, like, think we were conjoined twins or something, or even triplets. Let me kill this puppy again. My snipe, I just want another Pokemon. <laughs> I just want some sense of a team and not just one Pokemon that's like, you know those Pokemon saves where you just have one Pokemon that gets really, really strong and then you don't really bother with anyone else? I hate that. I hate that. Oh yeah, let's watch this one. Let's watch whatever this one can do to me. Thank you, bye. I got 40 experience from her starter Pokemon. Woo! You're a tough cookie, Brenda! I'm gonna work hard on training my Pokemon so we won't lose anymore. Okay, bye bye. Yeah, run. Because I don't like you. It's so weird, like, I usually, like, I feel like I know most about most, like, I know a lot about Pokemon, but these cities, like, I don't recognize them at all. 
I know that this gym is the one where the monkeys. I think it's the one with the monkeys. And that means that I can get another Pokemon in this route. Because usually you can't catch a you can't capture Pokemon in the routes. But here you can. Because you get one. Isn't that true? He could be in the trainer's school. Yeah, shut up. I don't know where the trainer school is, but I feel like I seem to remember that it was like below. Oh, did we just tilt to the right? Do you have enough Pokeballs? Thank you for that. Because I'm gonna need another Pokemon very soon. Or I'm gonna die. <laughs> Cute. You think this season of Game of Thrones is horrible? Oh, I love it. it I, it's so good. I love this season. I wrote 2,000 words. No, I did not. I've been whining about it on Twitter a lot. I love this season. It's been a decent season of Veep. Um, a little bit rushed, maybe? But... It's, it's been a good season. Um, have you seen the finale of Beep then? Okay, this is not a trainer school, I'm guessing. Or was it? I didn't actually pay attention. This is where Fennel lives. Okay, so I have to go back here. What is up here? A place for novice trainers. This is Dream Yard. Is this like a trainer? Since they said novice trainer, like does they mean does that mean she's gonna be like high level? I can't deal. I can't deal with this. This is so ex so extremely scary. This bitch has critical hit written all over her face. Don't. Bad Katie. Kill it! I want to fire a Pokemon so I can go to Karis. Oh! Oh! Stop touching me! I warn you! Die. Thank you. Okay, I know I'm not supposed to go to the dream yard anyway, because I'm supposed to go to the trainer school, but I'm not sure where the trainer school is. So. But this is a new route. Can I capture a Pokemon here? I don't know. Probably not, actually. Isn't that where you isn't that where you can find like the fetus Pokemon or something? Isn't that it? It's like one of these places. I swear. Oh, I need more Pepsi. Thank you so much for waiting. What is this? This is the trainer school. Do any of you have like a quick claw for me or something? Because I feel like that's what you get in every single one of these trainer schools. They give you a little quick claw. Okay, cool. Leave me alone. Yes, I can take. Which of the following item heals poison? Antidote. Which of the following items makes up a sleeping Pokemon? I wonder which one it's going to be. Oh, a full heal, I guess. Cool. Oh my god, oh, I don't want to talk to these people. I really don't want to see these people. They're not my friends.
Well, this bitch probably knows a fire type move already. I'm not on four levels higher than you, but it's still it it's a bitch. Okay, how much tackle is up in power, isn't it? Holy shit, no! Oh my god, that was a critical hit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stay away from me and my son. Heal my son right now. Oh fuck, he's, he's taking down my defense. He had an orange berry. Die! No! Oh my god, just kill it, just kill it. Oh, holy fuck. <laughs> I hate that slow challenges. No, he's not dead yet! Oh my god, heal my little puss. I only have one Pokemon! Be kind to me! He can use 